Last episode on Jeff House. You know, I'm a bigger type of guard, so if I ever get a chance to post up, I will. For him, the big thing is obviously his body. He has a frame, so we're trying to put on some mass on him. This crib is crazy. Mike Miller, I just want something like this from me and my family. Should I let the world know where I'm at, man? I'm at the draft combine. Me and my agent and my family decided for me not to participate in any of the drills. Wow, I'm in Chicago at the, at the combine now, so it was like dream come true. I really was like surprised, honestly, just because for the NBA combine. It's here now, something you've been dreaming of as a kid, and it finally came, so I was still in shock when I got there. The drill I probably most happy with was the shuttle run. I was excited with three points going through. That's where I'm from, and now I'm just here, enjoying the moment. Players really just go out there and have fun, so the NBA, how you can shoot, your athleticism. My blood was flowing. I really just wanted to show out some more, honestly. Yeah, I was tired, but it's a moment you just can't forget, so you got to be there. So I just soaked it all in, enjoyed everything that was there, and it was crazy. Draft House Chef Showdown. We're using those ingredients right there to cook an omelet. We're judging on taste, presentation, and the least amount of eggshells in my food. Y'all ready? Yeah, Let's got you. Let's get it. I don't feel like it's on. You eat cheese? I love cheese, man. I'm a huge fan of cheese, so. Yeah, yeah. we can do that. Yeah. That's, that's, that's the chef we like. like. Perfect. But Jabari is off to the races. Oh, yeah, ask me have I ever cooked before. Y'all be cooking at home? No. <laughs> no, I think y'all probably do. I always cook his Bama. And I was just like, nah, I just cook Bama. Referring to Alabama. Two, went 2-0 two on him last year, so. I personally wouldn't let him say that, but. I can't say nothing about it, we lost. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what? Why don't you guys apply the cooking spray? It's right there. I already did. <laughs> oh, that is oh, that's not a good job. stick. I got you, bro. I'm getting yeah, my foot game. For yeah, you done, bro. I'm not a breakfast guy myself. I don't really eat breakfast like that, so. Yeah, they're all gonna fail. 30 seconds. That looks so nasty. I'm not, <laughs> I refuse to eat that. Tata, I probably the worst I ever seen. All right guys, time for y'all to present what you made. Look, about to make my own restaurant. We cook everything, but we more of a dinner type. Mm. What you think, gang? Hey, appearance, I give you a two. Taste, I give you a zero. This is not cooked properly. All right, well, this I'd is, like to see you to make me one. This is an awful meal. What you got for me, man? I got this cheese egg omelet, you know, with salt and pepper. Uh -huh. Wow, it's like you listen. I kind of felt like Jabari cheated. He kept asking the chef questions and all that. Mmm. Yeah. I give you about an eight for a taste. Could have done with a little bit more salt. I'll take that. All right, JD. Omelet, cheese, a little bit of pepper, not a lot. Mm -hmm. Ten. Wow. <laughs> now the presentation, it does look a little odd. I give about a three for the presentation. I think everyone had the same presentation, so I don't know how everyone got different scores on that. All right, y'all, we're gonna give Jabari the win with 13 points. Congratulations on a well-earned victory. I think I went against some inexperienced opponents, but I'll take the win. A lot of people assume I gotta see the basket to score. Just like they assume they can't afford great insurance. All day. For surprisingly great rates to fit any budget, like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. We're in Auburn, back at home for this banquet. I'm happy to be here. I'm, I'm ready to see my teammates, see my brother, so I'm excited. Yeah, they have me projected maybe top three picks, so 
the decision wasn't really hard for me, but it was just tough leaving leaving the school, leaving somewhere where I put so much work in, so much hours in, blood, sweat, tears. So it was just tough for me, but um, I'm excited for the next step. I beat you three one. <sighs> nah, he just say three one. Now, nah. who memory better, mine or his? <laughs> Are you off then? You don't stay on when you lose. <laughs> okay, that's all right, that's all right. Don't be grandma like that. All right. You know, everybody knew I was probably going to end up into the draft, but when I finally made my decision, they was excited for me, happy for me. Okay, we can get a picture. Jabari Smith, the MVP. Thank you guys for the fans. Thank you everybody. I'm going to be an all man for life. This is my home. Love y'all, boy. I really wouldn't call it pressure. I feel like it's a blessing, really. You know, I've been dealing with pressure since I was ranked fifth in the country, sixth in the country, so it's nothing new to me. The work I put in, the hours I put in has prepared me for this moment, and it's the reason I'm here, so. I won't need those no more. I wasn't thinking about it too much, and then when the season ended, it hit me like, it's kind of over, you know, it's kind of time to go to the next step and, and into the draft. See y'all in New York City. We go Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. We try to touch on everything. When I'm in the gym working and just pushing myself, I feel like nothing else really matters. The problems that I'm going through off the court, like, it's just, it's just gone. How we, y'all? One, two, three, no days off, boy. We finish off with five minutes shooting. Always want to get a lot of reps in, a lot of opportunities for him just to get the ball off his fingertips. Everything is just so focused on basketball. It's like I don't be thinking about nothing else. I don't want to say we just get ready for the draft. I, I want to get ready for the first game of the season. For me to actually be in a position to where I'm getting ready for draft, it's really a blessing. Man, I've been doing this for about 12 years now. Mostly I've worked with Lamar Jackson, Michael Irvin, Cam Jordan, and several others. You don't have a suit before? Nah, I'm not really the suit type. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, I never wore a suit. I don't know what y'all kids doing, though. You ain't go to prom? Nah. You didn't even go to prom. Measurement's done. Now let's figure out what you might want to look like. You really can wear anything. You got good complexion, your build is good, so really there's almost nothing you can't wear. Soaking it all in, because you only get to go through this once. I like this one. What is this, blue, right? Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Just a clean piece, you know what I'm saying? And then just put some sneakers on with it. They ain't gotta be all extra blamed out. Maybe you got a lot of jewelry. Maybe you let the jewelry do the talk. Yeah, okay, okay, you okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. You know? I mean, if you want your name all throughout it and all that kind of stuff, if you want a logo or anything. No, the inside I want it to say Phoenix Sun. Like, if I open it, on this side it could be like Phoenix, PHX, and on this side it could be Sun. S-O-N. I like where you going with this nephew. I'm a Phoenix son, like, Phoenix is my city pretty much. You the son? Yeah, really much. I'm just Phoenix raised, making it for Phoenix pretty much. Well, sir, appreciate you. All right, bro. Yes, sir. All right, bro. When you came to Cali and your team played in this gym and using the super pool, then I mean your team was considered one of the best. Do you miss AAU? Oh, D, hell yeah. Crew <laughs> Washington, he a junior, about to be a senior. Watch, see what he do. It's good, it's good environment. No COVID or nothing. Co college coaches are finally back in the gym. It's everybody's dream to go to college, so it's always good, you know, for them to be out here playing and just have college coaches here watching them. Uh, I'm just really excited for them to see what their future holds. Easy. Ooh, I stand for them. Two people on their team, they got head tapped, so best believe when they had this meet, I'm gonna go over there and 
let them know they got head tap. Growing up, I was always playing here, so like, True, Tyreek always being around, seeing me playing here, they know how important this gym is to me and all that. Uh, now it's True's turn, to, he plays here now. Good ball movement, fellas. Good free throw line, cut back door every time. Another dub in the books. They undefeated right now, they got one last night, got their first one early this morning. Seeing his journey, that just made me want to go get offers just like him. I seen bro do it, it's only right for me to step up and do it right next to him. He has other things to worry about, but he came out here to support me, and that's just love. Next time on Draft House. You know, Friday days are where you just showcase your talents. Yeah, you know, atmosphere is a little bit intense. I headed over to Stone Mountain, get some conditioning, get some leg work in. Recovery is very, very important. You never know when your body is just going to shut down. Next thing you know, June 23rd will be like a week or two away. So it's just like, that's the day of the draft. It's a big day. Yo, Megan, what you got on? I mean, besides this video on my laptop, I'm rocking the Star Play Collection. Sheesh, that's a banger. Where'd you get that? The Overtime Shop, duh! Just click right here and get fed like me.